or reflect it. Well, this would be a good stage for Palu then, because uh, has a counter ready to go and reflector. And uh, small battlefield, so Steve's going to have a little room to work with, but uh, I think this favors Palu a bit more with just how she works in general with her kit. Yeah, this stage favors Palu a lot. I also just think that Palu does well against Steve. Especially since Minecart does kind of get shut down by her down B entirely. Um, as well as her good edge guarding, because her Nair, I'm pretty sure, just goes through Elektra. And then, ledge trapping in general is probably going to be a breeze a little bit for Polly, just because of down tilt. Able to catch a lot, and Steve, and one thing we know that's bad with Steve is his recovery is pretty bad. It's, yeah, it's it's like, it's just not good. It, 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 yeah, if you're going up, you're not going to go far. It's it's pretty, pretty rough, so that probably would make Steve a little, I guess, underwhelming when it comes to uh, just fighting him competitively. But as we saw before, I'm pretty sure we saw um, Aaron won Juice Box with Steve. Well, Alex actually. So it definitely shows that you can do it if you play it right. Okay, he tried to go for the uh, minecart combo with, with the anvil. Also, Steve's grab is really weird. Like every weird. part of it looks super super different than every other character it's just a mini isabel command grab yeah Gold as well fishing. the actual being grabbed animation because you're in the fence and then his actual rows all being beyond pivot oh gonna get hit with the minecart trying to get back on stage i like steve's animations they make me laugh especially when he texts because he steve, doesn't oh, just text. steve is steve is the funny haha -ha meme character like actually because he looks silly, but it's all like Ooh. true to Minecraft. Also, that was a good read. Because in Minecraft, you just have these like basic, funny animations. Right, and that's just how it. That's just how it's gonna also, look. Also, talk about how Steve has the worst crouch in Smash history. Worst crouch? What do you mean? Usage-wise, actual like objective usage-wise. It's all. It's just straight mind it's games. Funny. It's the funniest crouch because it's, it's the the spamming shift, the hello. But in like, in terms of usage, it's actually. <laughs> oh yeah, because he doesn't really have knees, so he can't. It's really like Sam. It's like Sam's crouch. crouch, where it doesn't do much, but this one actually does nothing for him. Nope, it just only tells the player if you're like getting ahead with some BS, and then you're just like, ha ha ha. Oh no! Like that. No! <laughs> yeah, block any recoveries without hitboxes get really, really hurt by blocks. Um, but also Snoofle like had to instantly put those blocks out there, and they almost disappear. He knew what he wanted, and he's getting a lot going right now. He probably he feels a lot more confidence with that read, for probably. sure. And, and he's got gold, you're... so everything of his is faster. You're right, and once I get diamond, it gets real. That's like that's like Joker Arsons out because that does so much. The bear is the same, but everything else no. Also, that drop down jump uh, up there. You got diamond really well. Oh, he got the diamond. Diamond with rage? No, thank you. Oh, bye, Palu. Oh, I'm surprised he didn't go for the diamond upgrade. Cause that was the that oh! Was, he got lucky. Well, actually, I think it always spawns on him. Yeah. Of course, so if you're that... moving. Uh oh. Oh, he uses the blocks. I definitely want to see more block play. Cause yeah, that does mess up teleport. That's that's pretty wild. He's Probably. had good block play with um combo extension. They're gonna pierce. Not gonna take it, but really close. 154. It's only a matter of time before one of her straight hits is gonna take the stock. And Ooh. Snufo. Oh, well, first off, getting hit by that. But also, he's always been doing minecart and then letting it go almost immediately. What? Also, that was an unfortunate escape. <laughs> Probably a missed input. <laughs> what? It was like a big. It was like a big gust of wind came by and just blew him off the stage. <laughs> that was. That suspect. I don't know if maybe he like inputted it and thought that he could like do a loop de loop and go backwards. Do a loop de loop and go. And it's looking. SD. Man. That that's a momentum killer. I don't know. Like he was doing great and then yeah, just a straight and up. And then all of a sudden he just he literally just kills himself as he I wonder what he tried to do, because it up be sideways, that's I he think just side B. I think he tried to like up maybe he tried to like up air and then inputted a side B, but he was still holding up. Anti really, really just being like, all right, <laughs> sweet, <laughs> GG. <laughs> uh, stage wise, 
I think more space for Steve is going to be in his favor because it gives Polly room to move, but like she really likes being in rather than putting you in awkward spots. I don't think as, the like... smaller stage hurt Snoofle that much in the last no. game because he seems to do fine. But Steve's disadvantage is pretty booty. So if you take him to the smaller stage and he's yeah. just constantly getting stuck at slight disadvantage, that's going to be just enough to not let him confidently put out his projectiles, especially against Polly, because Polly could just take advantage of that so fast. Run it back. Go. The, the the sound animations are really funny for Steve too. Like the meat. Yeah, they're good. The digging, like plop 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 plop. <laughs> Steve has really really clever like design, like just to look at. And just like observe like what they did with the character as an actual fighter there's something that's like that's weird yeah he, he's cool he's a cool dlc character at first when i saw him like i don't want to fight this because i didn't know what the blocks did but after like seeing him I'm like okay i, can get I also down thought that his that we all we we all thought his down tilt was busted because it would like slow it was basically pk fire no! um, speaking of unfortunate fds um bye we bye. thought that his like jab and his nair were broken because of the sword like weak sword swing like we thought everything right. was busted busted because he had these like zero to death I mean, it turns out that it's like it takes a lot to do anything yeah it's like if that's just like any that's probably what he wanted to do before right there when he did the ubby but pretty pretty much every, every time a new character comes out you only should gonna show the good stuff usually you don't show a lot of bad stuff like right well when you're fighting a computer it's hard to show the bad stuff exactly so that's why it's, it's like not really on purpose that we don't show the bad stuff it's because we're not fighting against like we're not we're not showing an opportunity to fight Ooh. to show the bad stuff also that was a good place on the tnt to kind of block her in oh and he's got diamond and she's at 91. this isn't looking good for balu i do love minecart i think it's a funny move it's and it's a command oh, oh. <laughs> no mashing no Actually, ticket mash no rad yes yeah you, you literally mashed it Okay. I, I'm pretty sure, yeah, it's just like a command grab. It's crazy. I think you have to be able to, considering how it, long she's stuck. It's this one, It's probably the safest command grab in the game, by far. Yeah. To be able to lift someone that far, and it has a hurt box, like two or three, depending on where you get hit, that's pretty good. And the fact that without mashing, he was able to combo. I love TNT. That's crazy. I like it because it doesn't seem too, too busted, because it does take a... It's like he has to do actual setup for it to uh, like explode. Oh. There's a good read with the back air in in the name of one of the greats. Good back air. Steve. The bear boy. Damn. That was a good. That was a good two stocked. So he just said, "All right." Yes, yeah, Nufel said game one was a mistake, and I'll show you why. That was a warm up. Now I'm really blocking. With a button check. <laughs> Block for check. Steve, a button check. For Palu, a button match. Steve has no fingers. It's all blocked. It's just crazy it's to blocked. see. Him. It's like, this is a smash right now. This is wild. I think because he was such an early smash, like, meme pick. Like, hot, like it would be funny to see Steve, but it would never happen because it's so stupid. So I think everybody had it in the back of their mind that they would kind of, like, that you looked at one of those wish lists and you saw Steve and you, like, you didn't say no to it. You just said it's <laughs> not going to happen. Right, like, well, yeah, sure. Like, I'd love if that happened. It'd like, be funny. Thinking. Right. Well, but also, like, who doesn't, like, I, I, the only reason someone doesn't like Minecraft is if it's just not the thing. No one, right. and even no then one you like, don't... hates Minecraft. You're just like, ah, just, it's just not for me. Right, like, That's Absolutely. really the worst it gets. Yeah, Other I'm than that, that guy, people like, like Minecraft. Never, never, never really got into it, but, like, whatever. I got into it a little too much. I got into modding. I didn't actually make mods, I just played them. Oh, okay. Modded yeah. Minecraft is lit. Let me tell no, you, modded, stuff like modded Minecraft and things like that is so lit. Because you just so, get cool stuff that the actual devs are, like, too afraid to put in. That is pretty cool. Because, like, not everyone would like it, but I like it. Honestly, one of the favorite things, one of my best times in Minecraft was with uh, Skyblock. I love it as a concept. 
Is that the one where you're on like a small little island you're in the on, sky? Like, you're on like a four by four space with a tree, and that's yeah, crazy. that. I never understood it. I didn't know what I was supposed to do, and I because I didn't know what the co I didn't know the cobblestone generator was a thing. I just had never heard of it or seen it, so I didn't realize you were supposed to like do that. Yeah. It was only until years later when I saw memes about like uh like mario and luigi brother did you mess up the cobblestone generator <laughs> i was like oh i didn't realize there's like a block like infinite block generator because you know minecraft or mechanics also that crafting table actually giving him this combo because of the extension on her um uh side b because she hit the crafting table i like this counter pick this has a lot more options and gets a lot more, I think, once she's actually in than Palo does. Uh, free range to go around the Minecraft, where, or, or Minecart, not Minecraft. The Minecraft. Uh, Palo had to just mainly jump, but she's literally, literally, she's really vertical, I guess. She's fast, but like, she can only go so far. So, and Yoshi's story, so you get triplats, but also that can come to haunt you with these blocks. Blocks literally can like make any space kind of work for them, and that's what's scary about this character. Blocks can make any... Uh, stage triplats basically, and that's because you can just make a block and then right. it's like, oh well, he happened to, you know, it's the same as if he had a platform there and landed on it. Basically. So, I just want to chime in really quick and just say that attention to detail is more kind. So instead of mining dirt on this stage, he mines wool. Oh, does he? I, oh, that's what that was. I didn't even realize. Yeah, they have a. They actually have a really like smart uh, array of uh, materials that he uses depending on what stage he's on. Oh! This is a really good read. She's been approaching from like above like that a lot. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean like you probably shouldn't be jumping so much, especially if like he's countering it with the minecart. That's literally what you're trying to avoid when you jump. So we'll probably want to like ease up on that, maybe go for some like uh, empty hops going back, spacing out a little bit more. Uh, oh, no. Unfortunate SD. <laughs> No! I but felt like, that one in my soul, that, though. Oh, that's, that's when Steve's uh, down, or uh, down. Uh, his crouch, crouch comes in handy, because he gets yeah. a look. Be like, hey, you're dead. After D -D -D. No, no remorse, no emotion, just you're gone. All right, next You're not drawing an like, L out of the dirt blocks. Oh, look, he said I didn't even need anything. Whatever. Yeah, he can hit you with, he can do everything with just like bare hands. I think, I don't know if the hitboxes are the same, probably. I'd have to look. Um, it's running away with this. Yeah, I mean, kind of. Just a little bit. I Maybe think a lot. I think it's hard for to be behind against this character because you have to approach a little bit more than he does, and that's exactly what he wants. Yeah, Steve gets a lot off of like running away and then kind of basically charging himself up until he's ready. Yeah, he's definitely a, a, he goes for whips a lot, and he has diamond. Oh, this is not looking good for hentai god. He's gonna have to look, pray for another god. Just to <laughs> take away the stock. Cause Steve's saying no. Pray. Mm hmm Your choice, man, because the mine mine carts are coming. You got our pickaxe swing side to side. Oh no! Oh, yeah, my the placing god. was not right. He knew if he actually went for the explosion, um, Hentai God could have on reaction just kind of avoided it. His hits are so meaty! Your shield's almost gone! And the cut! And the catch! Yeah. Bye! Snoofle with the Steve. 2 1 over Hentai God. Moving on. And look at this. Oh, that's great. 